giant has answered. He comes from a land older than mankind. And the Northmen call upon his flaming sword to raise their enemies to the ground. Find him, Senua. And spill his blood. She found the wretched old fool on her way back from the wilds. An outcast. He was badly burnt all over. She took pity on him, for he was not long for this world. Like her, who he spoke of his own darkness. The Northmen. human flesh <laughs> and I still hear their cries carried in the wind do you hear them too Senua yes, yes. I heard their screams and I still hear them now path to Helheim is sealed to the living, but you already walk amongst the dead. Look towards the gate, and you will see that it has opened.
The Northmen tell this story. Before the Earth was created, there was a world called Muspel. Because it was in the south, it was bright and hot, flaming, burning. Sparks that flew out from Muspel became the stars. Other sparks melted ice in the frozen world of Niflheim, creating the body of the first giant, Ymir. Muspel is one of the nine worlds, and is now the land of the fire giants. And people from elsewhere cannot endure a journey there. of their tongue to beg for mercy, and they took me as a slave. I wish now that they had slaughtered me like the others. I rode their storm of fire, death, slavery to many lands. This darkness you speak of? <laughs> I know it well. And I'm still here to fight it. see a fire gate of Surt, know that only a sacrifice will stoke the fires of Muspel and let the dead walk through. Find the fire, Senua, to follow the path to Surt.
look away from the horrors it does offer. Because you cannot overcome suffering if you refuse to look at it. Northmen say that the defender of Muspel is called Surt, the foremost of the fire giants. His name means the Black One, because he is like something burnt. The Northmen believe that he sits at the border of Muspel with his flaming sword, and at the end of the world he will leave his post. He will travel to Asgard and Midgard, waging war against all the gods. He will be victorious, and then burn the whole world with fire. Sacrifices, burning slaves like me to reveal the path to Surt. I searched for meaning in their suffering, in their eyes. But they just screamed like helpless pigs. Northmen believe that the world will be destroyed someday. They call it Ragnarok, the destiny of the gods. Asgard will be attacked by Surt and the fire giants. A monstrous wolf will swallow the sun, and the gods will fight in vain against their enemies. There is nothing they can do to prevent it, but Odin ever seeks knowledge and magic, hoping, hoping to find a way to postpone that dark day.
Answer your prayers, Senua. I asked the gods for mercy, all of them, even theirs. None answered. In the end, I set myself free. Defy the gods, Senua. Find your own path, like I find mine. My gods abandoned me. I am alone. The Northmen say that at Ragnarok, the sons of Muspel will travel to battle in the ship called Nagalfar, the corpse ship. And when the sons of Muspel leave the ship and ride to battle, it will be as though the sky had split open, and Surt will lead them. Wherever he goes, flame will erupt before him, and fires will burn behind him. The Northmen of Hell worship the Devourers, insatiable gods of darkness. I come from Eren, Senua, where I once followed my own gods, the Tuatha de Danann. Why did you abandon your gods? Senua, I was a man of knowledge, not a warrior. To survive, I did things. Like you, Cinema. The man I once was has died. And when that happens, even gods you worship can die with you.
Have the courage to shed your tears. Raise your word to the crime! My world is dead. Only then, as with a newborn, will you see the world anew. No, I see nothing now. Northmen say that what we see as a rainbow is the bridge that goes from the world of men to the world of the gods. For now, they say the frost giants and the mountain giants cannot cross it. But they say that when Ragnarok comes, not a thing in this world will be safe. The rainbow bridge will break under the onslaught of the fire giants riding on flaming steeds. Senua, I have seen the fire of Surt spread far and wide, and to our lands. Ragnarok is coming. Tell me truth. How did you escape your darkness? Senua, once I found my purpose, I was no longer enslaved to the suffering I had to endure to reach it. Unclouded by fear, I could see it clearly in others. Even my captors feared the fire of Surt. And so, during one raid, I took my chance and ran, knowing that they would not follow. A fool ran into the fire. <laughs> they left me for dead. Maybe they were right to. But here I am. Free. I'm glad I found you in the wilds. I wouldn't have made it without you.
so can you. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. This darkness takes everything. Everyone. Senua. Are you sure you want to do this? We can fight this together. Side by side. We always do. This is my battle. I have to face it alone, away from you. Where will you go? I don't know. For how long? I don't know. I believe in you. You know that. Just promise me that you will come back to me. I want you to say it. I want you to say it. I will come back to you. I promise.
every battle won. A greater battle takes its place. And so it goes. Until we fall. And in the end, we all fall. Even the gods have their time. Yet we still go on. Why? I made a promise. Mm. And I will go to hell to keep it. I die free. Knowing you will carry my stories with you. Thank <laughs> you. 